Hello guys, my name is Amit and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to break values of a cell or in other words, how to split a cell in uh, two cells or uh, how much ever you want. So let's understand how to do this. Uh, by taking an example, I have some names here and you can see these names. Uh, what I mean by splitting a cell? Uh, it is not splitting the cell, it is just splitting the values of a uh, cell, uh, breaking the values of cell in two. Uh, suppose I have these names, I want to split this, uh, break these values in two cells, that is first name and last name. How to do this? I will be showing you. It is very simple. First of all, we need to copy the data, uh, the names that we have or whatever you uh, want to split in. So just copy this and paste it here, I will paste it here. So now, don't forget to uh, select all this because we are going to split this. So it's already selected this is. What next we have to do is uh, we come here on data, we select this and then we have something called text to column. Just select this as well. Once you do that, uh, we can see two options here. Uh, one is delimited and one is fixed width. Since the names are not, in a, the width of the names are not the same, it, it varies, you can see everywhere. Uh, here the width is little, um, uh, I mean small, and then here we have, here the width is bigger. So all the width of the names are different, so we have to select delimited option here and then press next and how do the names differ how do we want to break the names uh, we, we have to set a parameter or something like that so that uh, excel understands how how do you want the name to be uh, which which all part of the name should be in first name and which all part should be in the last name so we want to break here the cells in uh, we can see uh, the names as here k dot natish so one thing is this dot this full stop so the first name should include K and the last name should include the letters or the word name that we have after full stop. So one is this dot and then uh, we can see the dot here as well the same things and here we don't we had just have the single name and then we have two names again but uh, here the names are uh, separated by space in all these names it is separated by space so we have two variables here one is the space and the second thing is this full stop this dot so we have to select this both options one is space we can see the space is already selected if not you can select and you just check box this once you do that it is selected and then the second thing is full stop this dot just uh, we don't have the option for full stop or dot here uh, you can select this other and just put in full stop here once you enter full stop, you can hear, here itself see that the name has been split it in two. So that's it. Just press next and finish. And you can see here the names have been separated. First name includes K where we had full stop. And the other part after the full stop is in the last name. And then uh, the, the, the name that was the single names, which did not had any full stop or a space, uh, is in the first name itself. Their last names are vacant empty. And the name which included uh, space have been split into two. So this is the way you can split anything, any, uh, any, I mean, break the values of cells, uh, whatever values you have or whatever data you have. And this is the method of doing that so it's very simple and it's very helpful as well uh, so we all face this problem uh, quite a time while co suppose we copy some data from somewhere and then it is difficult to split those cells so this is the way you can do it and uh, that's it in case if you have any query or any doubt about this uh, video or in uh, this uh, tutorial you can comment me your problems your queries I'll try to solve them and yeah so that's it for today i hope you all enjoy the video if you have any doubt or queries again you can comment me and please don't forget to like and subscribe this video see you soon up till then take care thank you